This is £10,000. And over the next 24 hours, these gamers are going to be competing in a bunch of different challenges to win it all. Yeah! So here's what's going to happen. There'll be three rounds, each with its own gaming-related challenge. Each round, one contestant will be eliminated until there are only two people left. Well, they'll compete for the prize money. This is going to be a crazy video. So let's meet the contestants. I'm Dan Cole, and I'm here to take over. The prize is mine. My name is Guinea. I'm here for the chaos. And um, yeah, I think I'm going to win. I think. My name is Sam, and I don't care who stands in my way, that money is coming home with me. I will scheme. I will screw over anybody I need to. My name's Harvey, and... I'm just here. Now that we've met everybody, let's get into round one. For the first round, each contestant is going to be given a briefcase. And when they open their briefcase, they're going to be met with one of these four devices. An MSI Claw, Steam Deck, Lenovo Legion Go, and an ROG Alloy X. Now, these four devices all have different strengths and weaknesses that might help our gamers during their challenges. For round one, there'll be two challenges. Beat three bosses on Cuphead and win a game of Warzone. The first three people to do that will go through to round two. But there's a catch. For every time you guys die, There'll be 20 pound knocked off the prize fund. Oh my god! I'm done. Okay, you guys can get out the devices from underneath your chairs. You have two hours, and the timer starts now. Okay, jump onto Cuphead. Jump onto Cuphead. Now, Cuphead is an extremely hard game. In Cuphead, players have to dodge attacks and knock out bosses. And Harvey was able to knock out his first one within just three minutes. Oh my god, Harvey! Harvey's already completed one of the bosses. But I haven't started. Sam was too busy trying to optimize his console and had to get a move on. And that point was made even clearer when Dan Cole also finished his first boss. And just when it seemed Guinea was also making progress. You're on the wrong level. Am I on the wrong this level? Is, this is, that's running gun. You're supposed to play, be playing a boss. And then to make things even worse, his console randomly oh. died. What just happened? Guinea was not having a very good start to the challenge. As Sam had just completed his first boss as well. Okay, oh, thank God. Oh my well. God, that was close. Man. After six minutes, this is what everybody's progress look like and everybody seemed to be getting on great but this was all about the changes people moved on to the second boss oh, i died no and this death here would be the first of many <laughs> people kept dying left right and center oh, no 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 the money just kept Don't going down You guys are losing so much money. This is how much money they've already thrown away. And after the first 15 minutes, this is what everybody's progression looked like. However, they had collectively lost over 1,000 pound from the cash prize. And Guinea still hadn't even completed the first boss. So I decided to give him an offer. I'll play one boss, but it's gonna cost 100 pound out the prize. No, yeah, brother, yeah. please. Screw everyone else. Watch right. me do this, ready? Oh my God, you're actually great. Oh my gosh, I, love, I, I did it. Color. You did it! Now these guys are going to want to complete these challenges as quickly as possible because when their battery life hits zero, they're going to be charged £20 a minute for charging. And with the Lenovo Legion Go and MSI Claw having some of the worst battery lives, there's no wonder why Sam said this. How much would it be I'm to complete winning. two levels? 500 for two levels. Every single time they want to take off money, it takes off money for oh everybody God, else. So Sam accepted the deal. I want you to look at him. He's costing you no, no. five. Hundred big snackeroo. No, I completed the remaining two bosses for him, which took five hundred pound out of the cash prize. But as he was celebrating that fact, Harvey completed the third boss on his own. I've done it. I've done the third one. You've done the, I've third, done one. the third one. Which meant him and Sam were the first ones to move on to the second challenge. But whilst they started to play Warzone, Dan Cuttle didn't want to be left behind and took two hundred pound off the prize money for me to complete the last boss for him. <laughs> Meaning he now could start Warzone as well. That's if. The Steam Deck could actually load it up. Mine isn't working. After 15 minutes of troubleshooting, it turns out the Steam Deck just couldn't run Warzone. So if he wants to move on to round two, he's gonna need to find another way to play it. But as he was figuring that out, Guinea finished his final boss. <laughs> and now everything was level. Everybody has now only 45 minutes to get as high as they possibly can in a game of Warzone. If these guys get first place, they'll go straight through to the next round. But if no one makes first place, then the person out will be the person who got the lowest score. But before we could get started, everybody was facing problems. Sam's game was lagging badly. This could be the laggiest thing I've ever witnessed in my entire life. Guineas kept crashing as soon as he loaded up a game. Where's the screen gone? They just die. And Cool Steam Deck couldn't even open it. We've done a lot of tests and the thing is just not working. The only console without any problems was Harvey's ROG Ally, which put him firmly in the lead as he completed his first game of Warzone in 17th place. Now knowing this, 
Sam had a proposition for him. Do you want to? Do you want to team up? Let's Me and you. Let's do it. With Sam and Harvey now teamed up and now smashing through games together, it seems certain that they'd be going through to the next round together. So the battle for round two was now on between Cuttle and Guinea. However, neither of them could get into a proper game. It just completely crashed. I don't know if that's because it's overheating, but it's completely dead. Cuttle's only option to play Warzone was to try streaming it on GeForce Now. Meanwhile, Guinea found out that his game wouldn't crash as long as it was plugged in. Can you hear that? Wait. This thing is like overheating. So at the cost of £20 a minute, he charged up his device and tried to complete a game of Warzone. You get so much enjoyment of shredding money. I tried to help Cuttle set up a GeForce Now account, but there wasn't much time left. And Guinea had just finished his first Warzone game. I felt bad that Cuttle was going to go out over something that basically wasn't his fault. So I gave him £200 as we reached the final seconds of round one. Three, two, one. Yeah! Now these guys might be celebrating the fact that they made it through to the second round, but what they won't be celebrating is that all their Warzone and Copper deaths, as well as Guinea's £20 a minute for charging, has brought the total cash prize down to just over six grand. Now for round two, the contestants better have been keeping an eye on their battery life, for in the next round, they won't be able to charge up their device. Guinea currently has 46%, Sam has 30 and Harvey is way ahead in the lead with 59 In this round, everybody's going to be playing the game chained together in single player mode. Everybody Everybody will be trying to get as high as they can within the 30 minute time limit. And the player who's at the bottom gets eliminated. I'm gonna start a timer in three, two, one. Oh, we're going. Here we go. Oh my God, is this like a parkour game? Yes. Yeah. So I just found out that we're doing a parkour challenge. I'm not good at parkour. Finally, a game with no stupid mechanics, no frogs that punch you. For the first time, I'm actually going into this kind of feeling confident. But that confidence wouldn't last for long. We're at the 82 meter mark. Sam and Guinea's consoles just started lagging. Whoa, whoa, I'm lagging. It's lagging. Which couldn't be said for Harvey, who was making his way up the course. Because Guinea and Sam had to put their devices into power saving mode, their consoles just couldn't run the game. So to run it properly, they had to switch to standard mode, which then enabled them to play the game, but had a way higher risk of draining their battery life. Luckily for Harvey, though, he could run his game on max setting while still only losing minimal battery life due to the ROG LAX's 80 watt hour battery. In the first two minutes, everybody was hyper focused, taking it slow. This is so scary. Yeah, but I genuinely, I feel. I'm just looking at where my feet are going. But it wasn't long Whoa. before we nearly had our first fall. Oh. As you can tell by the noises, it's getting very intense. And things only got more intense as people moved up the course. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh my god, okay, no. oh, I'm what so scared. I don't that? Want to, I'm so scared. No, 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 no! I've fallen. Have you fallen? Oh, no, 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 this is not what I needed, man. Okay, I might have massively misjudged how difficult this is. Oh my god, no. You've oh. still got 25 minutes. Yeah, but so have these guys to get even further. If anything, you've got a, like a better head start on them when they fall. You actually think of it like that. If, if they size. fall, if, I will say that, if they fall. So as we hit the 25 minute mark, Sam started making his way back up the course. Harvey was absolutely flying ahead and Guinea. Whoa, oh, that's not fun. Well, Guinea was having his own issues. Just one, just Whoa, one. what? I just fell. I just fell. I just fell. I literally just fell. It didn't work. <clears throat> the jump pad didn't work. Oh my god, this is the greatest day the of my life. The jump pad did not work. So Guinea had to make his way back up again. But after another two minutes had passed, he wasn't that far behind Sam. Okay, Harvey's up 150 meters. Sam's on 100. Guinea is on 81. But as Sam moved up to the spinning wheel, Guinea realized that he wasn't going to have to stay in last place for much longer. Not again, not again, not again, the same place every time. There is 22 minutes remaining. Now that Harvey was so far at the top, he had a difficult decision to make. Stay firmly at the top or keep risking it to carry on his lead. Oh, 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 oh. I've done it. As we got to the 20 minute mark, Guinea had just completed the spinning wheel. Guinea's got through it. No, he hasn't. Oh, no. Is that where you were falling? Yeah, every time. Back, 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 back. Oh, oh. Oh, oh my god. You like no. I this is too this is too much for me to handle. And right after I said that, Harvey made his first right. mistake. What? Oh my god. You fallen? Yeah, but only to like a little bit below oh. me. I fell to like 170. Guys, I'm just gonna put this here. Because this is what is on the line right now. Don't show me that right now. I need I need, I need... No it didn't work! Okay. Oh my, oh my god! I thought you oh fell. my god! Okay. Oh my god! I right. genuinely did thought you not you... fall? No. I... Oh, I, I thought I thought you lost it all. That that genuinely could have been it. I thought the money distracted you. <laughs> Come on! 
I'm coming for you. Come on, come on. Once again, Sam found himself up against the spinning wheel. So I offered him £100 if he wanted me to complete it for him. Oh. I'm doing it again. I'm rinsing the bank account, but I don't care. Wait. Dancing! Dancing! Easy. Easy. That was most nerve-wracking moment of my life. I feel like I'm, I'm shaking. Getting, I'm getting a little sweaty. Dancing is good at gaming, guys. Who knew a man who built gaming sets? Oh my god! Is he no? Yes! 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 <laughs> I'm screwed! I'm screwed, dude! What am I gonna do? I got 15 minutes. Sam was now in second place, so he really took his time on the next part of the course. McGinney wasn't settling for last place as he started speeding his way back up to Sam. Guys, there is only 14 minutes left. 14 minutes! Guinea, this is a race against the clock. If you are stuck, oh. please. Oh, 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 my God. oh my God! Stop playing it so close. Just go for the jump. Oh my, yeah, he's actually quite close to you now. I'm actually a little no, bit no. terrified. There is only 12 minutes left, guys. And in the past few minutes, Guinea had caught up. He's there, he's it! He's already there. Which meant one thing Sam had to get moving now. Oh my god! Guinea was now hot on Sam's tail. Guys, there is 11 minutes left! No, this is not what I need! This is not what I need! They are both climbing up the ladder right now. It is a race to see whoever can get to the top. This is going to be close. What? I got boosted off! I'm down all the way! Boosted off! Are you joking? What do you mean? Bro, this is done. I've got 10 minutes. It happened to me as well. I survived it. Oh, brother, I'm done. I'm done. Sam. Don't, don't, don't rub it in. There is 10 minutes left, yes. right? This is the only time I will give this offer out. So about the fifth time this video, Dan Tick has offered me a lifeline. I will let you respawn back to your highest point, but for 2,000 pounds. What did I take the total to? 4,000. Pay everybody else's money to benefit myself. You might have discussed this, but also we, we only have 10 minutes. You've got time, dude. Listen, Guinea guys. Guinea got to 200 in about five minutes. You can do it in five minutes. I did it in like, and you've got more than five 15. minutes. If you go now. 15. Yeah, I mean, Guinea did it in five minutes. You, you, yeah, if you but I'm not Guinea and I'm taking it. I'm taking the deal. Get me back in this game. I don't care. Hold that. Oh, Get me back in this game. 2,000 pounds. 2,000 pounds. No. I paid double that. I paid no. double that for this game. Get me back in. Oh my god. He took the 2,000 pounds. What is he doing? Two grand. This is what it's all about, he ladies took and gentlemen. It. Winning. Winning is the aim. Two grand. Bring me to the top. Now that Sam was back in the game, Harvey was worried that his top spot was going to be taken, so decided to push on, but that was a bad mistake. I fell off. I fell off. I caught myself at 120. At 128. Guys, there is six minutes. Left. Knowing that there was enough time for Harvey to catch up, Sam and Guinea raced on, but then this yeah, happened. I'm waiting for Emily. No! I've fallen, I've fallen. How far? No, 169, 169. No, 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 no! With now only five minutes left, everything was to play for. Any mistakes around this point would be fatal. Oh! oh, sh oh. Why did I get hit off again? Who is that? There is four minutes remaining. Oh my god. This is going to be close. This is going to be so close. And on top of that, it didn't help that Sam and Giddy had nearly run out of battery. No! Oh. No! No! How far have you gone? Oh, no! How far have you gone? It's all the way. All the way? It's all oh the way. Yes! God, he's gone all the way to it's the bottom. The yes! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Three minutes, three and a half three minutes. minutes. But just when Guinea thought it was all over for him, this happened. Dude, it's over. No! Don't, don't say it's over! Keep going! Oh, I fell off again! I fell off, I fell off, I fell off, I fell off. How far? I don't know, 126. Guinea, it's not over! Oh, oh, keep going! Genuinely, I'm actually shaking. I don't know if you can see in my hands, but my hands are shaking with the console. I'm, I, I don't even know what I'm gonna do, man. This is genuinely stressing me out. Guys, that is two minutes remaining! Oh my god! Uh, I just fell again. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> the Legion Go is lagging every time I look down at this point. It's actually annoying. Guinea, put it down! Don't give up! Guinea, if you give up now and Sam falls, it's not over. You've got a minute 30! You've got one minute to get as high as you can and you just gotta hope that Sam or Harvey fall. There is 50 seconds. If I need this, come on! Is that in? Nine, eight, seven. Six, five, four, three. Oh my god, I fell again. One. Yes! <laughs> Come on. Yeah! Get in there. Oh my god. I can't believe I lost. 
Dude, I was terrible. I feel like <laughs> I feel like I'm bad at every challenge, and I finally had a glimpse of hope, and I feel like it just didn't go well. Yes! Get out! Hold that. I'm never seeing you again. So with Guinea out, Sam and Harvey are moving through to the final round, where they'll battle it out for the rest of the prize money. Gentlemen, it's the final round. This round will be an endurance test where the contestants will be competing against each other in multiple different games. When a contestant wins a game, they'll be able to keep on gaming. But if a contestant loses, they'll have to spend an hour in a sleep deprivation chamber. A specially designed room with a perfect sleeping temperature, no entertainment, and is in complete darkness to help whoever's in there get to sleep very easily. And if they close their eyes for more than 10 seconds, the other person walks away with all the money. We're starting this challenge at midnight, so the longer this carries on, the harder it's gonna get. Now this endurance test might not seem very fair, considering the fact that the ROG Ally X can last three times as long as the MSI Claw. So with those stats in mind, I had an offer to make to Sam. Right here, I have two briefcases. One of them has the remaining amount of money left, £4,000. The other one has something special in it. For £1,000, would you want to trade in your MSI Claw for an ROG Ally X? Give me the Ace of Sprog LIX, mate. Get that claw out of my hands. Give it to me. This is what I've been waiting for the entire time. So now that the playing field is leveled, let's move on to the first challenge. Which will be a 1v1 at Rocket League. The person who wins gets to carry on gaming. The person who loses has to go in the sleep deprivation room. You ready? I'm ready. <sighs> I've yeah. not played Rocket League since I was a sweaty 12 year old in my cousin's bedroom. The game got off to a quick start. Harvey soon took the lead. <laughs> oh no, 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 I can't slow down, I can't slow down! No! It is 1-0 to Harvey. It's over already. But Sam wasn't going to let the early goal dishearten. It's time to take it back. It's time to score a goal. Let's go. No! No! <laughs> if it gets to 10 nil, I'll resign myself to the sleeping chamber. <laughs> Sam losing the first game, he was the first person to enter the sleep chamber. Rocket League, Dan, Rocket League. Brother, come on. Come through. Oh, it's so dark. Oh, boy, I'm actually cooked. We can literally see if Sam's eyes are open or not. Like this infrared camera over here. Dan, you tuck me in. No. Dan! We'll be keeping an eye on him on here. No! How's the gaming going, Harvey? I'm not doing amazingly, because I'm, I'm used to Sam's level. It's worse than I thought. I actually feel way too relaxed. But genuinely, I can already feel my eyelids getting heavy. If he closes his eyes for more than 10 seconds, he's out. So as Harvey carried on gaming, Sam tried to keep himself entertained. But after 20 minutes, reality started to kick in. I'm not reaching a point that I could not think of a single more thing to say. Genuinely, I'm not sure if I can do this. I want to see if he's been keeping track of time. So I'm going to tell him that he's still got 50 minutes left, when in reality, he's only got 30. Sam? Yeah? You've got 50 minutes left, OK? No, 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 you're, no, you're joking. That's the first 10 minutes. I'm not joking. There's no way I'm spending another 50 minutes. No, please, brother, please tell me. <laughs> OK, bye. What's your battery life on? 87% still. The battery life on Harvey's ROG LAX was barely going down. And that's because of its absolutely huge 80 watt hour battery. Seriously. This thing is no joke. You see, ROG sent me this device last week to try out, and this thing is now my favorite way to play AAA games on the go. Like, this thing's battery life is so good. I was on a five hour flight the other day, and this thing didn't die on me. Like, it lasted the entire flight. Which is crazy considering that I was playing some pretty graphically intense games. I do want to say thank you to ROG for help making this video possible. And if you do want to check out the ROG LAX, I'll leave a link to it in the description. But, anyways, let's check out how Sam's doing. Oh, hang on a minute. His eyes are closed. One, two, three. Four, five, six. No, no, no. Ooh. You know he's stressing out so badly right now. It seemed that Sam was getting closer and closer to falling asleep. I've just got to keep talking. If I keep talking, I won't fall asleep. Sam has spent a full hour. It's time to wake him up. Hey. Yes, am I done? You done? Am I done? Yes! Yeah! <laughs> Come through. Yes! Oh my. That's a flashbang. Oh my god. <laughs> I cannot go back in there. Oh my god, can you see my eyes? Bro, I'm done. I'm back. He's returned. I'm gonna try very hard to get you there. <laughs> for your sake, do not go in that room, bro. But now it was time for challenge two. A race in full, guys. And the loser spends another hour 
in the sleep deprivation room. I will do anything not to get back there. I don't see myself going up in that room anytime soon. Oh. With both of these guys already tired, everything could come down to this challenge. It started off neck and neck, both guys jumping across the course until Sam made his first mistake. Doing well. Oh my god, no, 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 I can't go back in that sleep room, I can't go back in that sleep room. Harvey was firmly ahead, but after he took a wrong turn, Sam had a chance to take the lead. I didn't see Sam go miles ahead of me. Am I winning? Yeah, you're miles ahead. What? He's not that far away from the end. But as they both travelled towards the end of the course, Harvey had caught up, and that meant it was a straight sprint for the win. No, I'm coming close behind no, you. No, 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 don't talk to me, I don't, I don't want to hear you, I don't, I I don't want to feel the pressure. I don't I want to feel the pressure. You're on the last bit. Look, I'm here, Sam. I'm right behind you. Harvey was hot on Sam's tail, but Sam was more focused than ever. Oh, no, 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 no. Is he spring? Is he spring? Yes! Yes! Oh my god! Oh my god, I've won a game! That I've won close. a game or something! That was incredibly close. Hold that! Hold that! Dead gamer! With Sam winning game two, it meant that he could carry on gaming while Harvey was banished to the sleep room. Time for you to get into the sleep deprivation room. Get yourself very comfortable. This is gonna be awful. I'll see you in an hour. I'll see you later. And there he'll stay for the next hour. Let's look at him, let's look at him. <laughs> oh, so bored already. Well, I'm genuinely tweaking that. At least your brain is being stimulated. That's true. It could be worse, you it could be in the room. It seemed like Harvey's tactic for staying awake wasn't talking, but being active. He's definitely got restless leg syndrome. But as he hit the 45 minute mark, you could see the effects of the room starting to affect him. What is he doing? The hell is he doing? And with no clue of how long was left, you could see Harvey's energy starting to drain. Harvey. Yes? I'm coming to get you. Really? Hey, how did you do? Oh, I'm going mental. I know, bro, I saw you leaving your feet up, pulling faces. I was just trying to keep myself from going crazy. Uh, Definitely. I'm not going back in there again. <laughs> but now it's time to move on to the final challenge. The boys will be playing Warzone together, and whoever's console dies first goes in the sleep room. I want you to reveal your bachelor after me. 58. What's yours? 63. Oh. Let's jump into Warzone. Whilst these guys banged out games on Warzone, I took an hour and a half nap in the sleep room. Listen, it was 3 a.m. I was very tired. And when I came back out, their battery lives were nearly drained. With Sam just in the lead by 10%. However, at this point, they had really started to work together as a team and found themselves in a very good position. We're top five. We're top five. We can actually do this. This is our chance. So for once, I decided to give them a chance to win some of their money back. If you guys win a game of Warzone, <laughs> I'll add five grand the prize for this is no money's on the this line this is massive i'm in one of the little toilets that's like me at school when i was getting bullied i can relate yeah. no not in with me oh my god i thought i was someone else <laughs> at this point harvey's console was down to nine percent and it looked like he was next in the sleeping chamber oh, they're down left they're down there they're down to the left oh my god, oh my god. They're, down, they're, down. they're down to the left <gasps> no no, no. no. Oh. guys no 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 I thought that was our moment. That should have been our moment. With both of their batteries now extremely low, this was their last match before one of them would be sent to the sleep chamber. Yeah. No! Sorry. I'll see you on the other side, brother. Go and do it for me. 3% this is where it ends. It's all so emotional. No, 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 on the right, on the right, up the stairs, on the right. That's it. And that's it. It's been a fantastic journey, my friend. Harvey, your device is now dead. So you've got to go to the sleep chamber. However, you've only got to stay in there until his device runs out. Okay. Oh, but that's fine, that's brother. Fine. I'm 11 percent. Bro, fine. that's five minutes. Fine. I'll see you right back here. I believe in you. We're going to rejoin together, and our journey will continue. That's fine. I believe. I'll be you. back. Yeah. I hope it's not. Yeah. You've got it. Five minutes. I believe in you. All right. Other time. I'll see you on the other side. Good luck. Oh dear, Harvey. This feels all too familiar, but at least it's only for five minutes this time. Have a nice little nap, man. We just hope he comes back. I just hope he comes back. See back. you in a bit. See you on the other side. And the door is closed. At least I can get comfy knowing this is only going to go on for five minutes. Well, little did Harvey know I was about to make Sam a deal. Sam, <sighs> Harvey's got to stay in that chamber until your device dies. What is your percentage currently on? 9%. 9%. Only 9. You know how I said at the start, you could charge a device up for £20 a minute. It does ring a bell. We've got three grand left. For a thousand pound, do you want 50 minutes of charging to keep Harvey in that room? 
We've been through so much together. We had a war zone partnership. He supported me through our chain together. He's helped me through so much in this See. game. See. At the end of the day, you better keep that briefcase open. That money's coming home with me. No. I said at the start, I will screw over anybody I need. He thinks he's going to be in there for 10 minutes. He could be in there for two hours. You are a oh, monster. No. Oh, five minutes feels so long in the sleep chamber. And as time went on, Harvey was getting more and more frustrated. Why am I still in this room? Harvey? Yeah? It's not time to come out. Go back to bed. Wait, <laughs> 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 you're saying on and on with no feeling. That is the most horrible thing. And the funny thing is, he's only got like, what, 10 minutes left? Wait, you only got 10 minutes? You're telling me I've got to see him yeah. again. I don't, I don't just take the money and go. Sam sat there hoping that Harvey would pass out and go to sleep. But Harvey remained strong despite not knowing how long he'd have to spend in there. And eventually, he was ready to come out. Harvey, oh, Yes. Do you know how long you've been in here for? No, I've got no idea. I've questioned myself if it even was meant to be five minutes. Yeah, you've been in here for literally about an hour. What, I thought I was coming out when his console went to zero. You might want to go and have a talk to Sam. Welcome back, mate. Good job. What have you done? You tell him. It was five minutes, wasn't it? It's not like five hours. He paid a thousand pounds to charge up his device for 50 minutes so you could spend longer in the sleep deprivation room. So you've just taken a third of the price money so that I can sit in there <laughs> for I don't even know how long. Yeah, in all fairness, I thought you weren't coming back, so. Well, it didn't make me more angry that I was in there for so right, long. Guys, guys, I want to go to bed. We can't, can't keep doing this all night. I'm going to give you one last ultimatum to, to figure this entire thing out, all right? Both of you take your seats. You guys, man. I am too tired to go on any longer, so I'm bringing it down to this. I've set up your devices, so it has the words split or steal. If you both choose split, you will walk away with a thousand pounds each. However, if one of you chooses steal and the other person chooses split, the other half will take all the money. However, just to put a little third twist in it, if you both choose steal and you both go home, We've nothing, and this whole thing <laughs> we would have been for genuinely nothing. I want you guys to have a little talk amongst yourselves. I think all I want to ask is, what reason do I have to trust you? You've shown me that you have the heart of a warrior. You've beaten every challenge, you deserve to win, do you know what I mean? You've done everything first. As someone who's as honest and as humble as me, I think it's just genuinely only fair if you get your split of money. Do you believe him? I don't know if I can. I don't think anyone else would, but do you believe him? I don't believe no. him, but this is up to you, not me. If you think about it, I've played it safe the whole time. I haven't taken risks, I've done the opposite. I've played it safe, I've paid money to go through, right? Surely splitting with you is the safe option. If anything, that's the way I can guarantee myself money, is if I split with you. For this one time, trust me, please. And I really do mean it this time. Okay. After everything they'd faced today, it all came down to this. Are you sticking with your choice? I'm not 100%. Gonna, I'm not 100%. I want you to show the other person what you chose in 10, 9, a long count, that 8, one. 7, <laughs> Six, five, four, three, two, one, show. Oh, no way. I don't know what you to do. Why would you steal? He's thought he's been one step ahead the whole time, but he hasn't been. I thought I could trust you. I, I, I thought I could trust you. I, the guy went out first got more than me. Oh my God. What a change in events. I feel for you, but you, ha you had this coming. Harvey, you absolute thank scumbag. <laughs> well played. Asus, thank you so much for this money. I'm going to head straight off and buy myself the ROG Ally X. Yeah! Come on! What a crazy ending to the video. To end the video off, I just want to say that I PayPal'd Harvey the money. For obvious reasons, this was prop money. And also just want to say thank you for watching the video. This is the longest video I've ever made. And it's also been the most expensive. So please like, subscribe, and maybe watch one of my other videos.